Hello, and welcome to another episode of I Place Assassin's Creed uh, Rogue. We are about to do some stuff. Very descriptive, wasn't I? There, uh, yeah, there's a steel mechanic in this game. Wow, well, I ran into some issues on the editing process. Hold uh, there! Uh, when I um, was putting it into a format that I could actually record, because I used DXTory and I used it some codecs, I could convert it to a different codecs that my editing software can actually like, read. I had a problem. Congratulations. You're dead. And I accidentally merged the in-game audio and the uh, me playing recording audio onto one track. So I actually can't move the in-game me to only the left side. So on this episode and the next two... Really? Someone is fleeing a jealous husband. What? What? That what? That was a stupid thing to say. This voice is still going to be on just the right side, so you'll still be able to tell which is playing game me and which is watching me play game me. It made absolutely no sense. What am I supposed to be doing? Why am I supposed to be going there? Oh, uh, okay. I don't care about my life stars. I'll do that eventually. What do you be needing today? I'm still too low. <laughs> but I also know I haven't hit my limit on yet, so... <laughs> the transport piece is not good. I think I get it. So I can store, I can transport any amount of any of this stuff. Um, but I can only transport 500 in total. Shit, mass. He ain't not giving me a total. <laughs> okay, well, whatever. Um, It's like maybe 250 right now, so I've still got room. Hopefully, it'll at least tell me when I'm full. We need more cloth. Later then. Um. Oh, yeah, I just got a. What the? What was that? Well, if we've any luck, hey, that ship minute. will lead us right to him. I make my own luck, Roll Liam. And Washington is running out of his. No, no, you stupid no, son of a... The you dirt was a pier. It was pier right next to you, and you are not able to climb this crap. Because you're an idiot. Don't you want to climb that? <sighs> Thanks for diving right next to the pier instead of on the pier. Uh, 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 that was awesome. Uh, Good job. Uh, I can't said chess. 
I never thought I'd say this to a complete stranger, but I owe you my life. I really don't like these horse dudes. That's a Borderlands 2 reference, by the way. If you don't get it, then you, you need to play that game. Because it's an awesome game, and Tiny Tina is like my favorite character in existence. Yes, thank you. That's exactly what I wanted you to do. Dive into the water. I'll need to get out immediately. Which ones are climbable because they have bird poop? but it might have actually been faster to fast travel to the viewpoint and then go to the boat. But yeah, whatever. Randomly killing a guy because I just don't like him. Hey, I'm crazy. Oh. It's kind of a lie. Yeah, I don't have enough to get all eight. What do you be needing today? Okay, well, um, nothing that uses cloth or wood. This is wood. Did not use wood. Okay. Sure. I didn't realize I used any. 
Let's go get some more cloth. My thanks for your trust, Captain. Really? I had stopped pushing the button a while ago. Loose and cut the wind! Loose all and trim sharp to the wind! Loose sail! Put out all she takes! Careful, Shane. These waters are full of enemies. Ha! Aye. There she is! All right, man. Time to be quiet. Lawrence Washington is a powerful businessman, a slave owner, and a leading Templar. We lost track of him about a year ago. I recently learned he was in Barbados, but I haven't been able to confirm that. Now, now you think he had something to do with the theft of the artifacts, don't you? I wouldn't put it past him. Haiti's a short voyage from Barbados, and his return to the colony certainly coincides with the arrival of the artifacts. We cannot let the Templars get control. Blockade, oh. Captain! Oh, this won't do. Shay, you must follow that ship on land. not survive. Can't do that. I've done this a couple Bring the Morrigan around another way. I can track that package and find Washington. Haul down and clue up for those maids! We're clear, Captain. Three dish vessels! They're all alone, sir! Yeah. And remember what I said, Shay. Washington must die. <laughs> Now that had to have been like poison his head because I was already off of the ship. I was nowhere near where I could have heard him if he had actually just said that. Especially not like it sounded like he said it right next to my ear. Oh, really? I want that's not the way I wanted you to go, you son of a Thanks for that. That was helpful. Nelson, it's that this game involves a whole lot of running. I really am. I should have gone that way. Actually, you know what? Just so you guys know what I'm talking about, let's. Ah, oh well. Aye. Oh, I want you to see that I can go this way. <laughs> I was actually planning on... Wow. Look, you can go this way. See, watch as I go this way the wrong way on purpose. It's just you can see that that way. As you can see, my attempt to hide and kill them did not work at all. Whoa. That was That's a what I was trying to do. frame rate spike. Oh well. up against the uh I don't I don't I don't want that. Oh actually I'm gonna have a knife sure. Oh 
Come on, hide up against the wall. There we go. Alright, stop. Who are you, you there? And you can't see me. In Unity, there's a button that you push when you're near a thing to press up against it, like I was trying to do with the. Uh, Hay barrel and over there, with them, which is actually nice having that button because it's so much easier than trying to get in the right place. Because that's like what I'm doing right now with the leaning up against the wall. That's like it does it by itself as long as you're in the right place and you push the button correctly. And of course he's too far for that to work, so I have to just regular kill him. That was interesting. And then when I do the regular kill, it does it like I was doing the ID kill anyway. I was gonna lead drop him, but that didn't work, obviously. Hey, Parker! You come back here, you mad maggot! I think I'm actually gonna stay here and wait until he stops. Yeah, I'm gonna just sit here and wait until he stops looking for me, and then I'm gonna ledge him. Right, like this. Now, where is that package? Hmm, don't let me hide against this thing. Hold you! I think not! Get back here now! Hold there! Mm. He thinks he can get away! Come back, you wicked coward! Well, that was hard. Rather do it where I was oh, hiding this? against it because it takes a lot less time, but whatever. Rifle. I've got a Red Rider BB gun. You there! Stay! Where? It's a dark How can that be? It makes no sound. It's for the present. Buster Washington. This is a strange surprise. Not quite what I was expecting. Now I must find Washington and interrogate him. Well, 
what the why whatever now get back up there and do the chest Shoulder, you you're a trouble maker, eh? Oh. 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 Jerkoff shot me. But he's also an idiot. Oh, really? Why are you... Well, stop going down. Bird poop, I can climb this. I need to get to Washington first. Then I'll worry about the artifacts. There we go. I got something with the whistle. this just to get a chest. Oh, he's just randomly killing passers-by. Oh my god! Not a single other soldier just came to help. Wow, he killed a lot of people. But whatever. I'm a pirate. Help! Loot the bodies. Help! Get the money. This is oh, now there's finally people coming to help. Running from way the hell over there. Wow.
And both those idiots died. Let's get back to whatever I was supposed to be doing. Well, lag spike. Yep, I got enough. Some frame rate lag. Hmm, that didn't work. Brother, are you sure you shouldn't be in bed? I am fine, George. Be a good host for my sake. Go to the wine cellar and get something special for our guests. I will. Gentlemen. is a bright spot in a troubled land. If I may make one request before I depart this life, please leave him in peace. He should have nothing to do with the troubles of the Templar cause. We all respect that sentiment, sir. You have my thanks, gentlemen. Master Smith, are you ready to leave on your voyage? Aye, sir. I shall return with answers. Master Wardrobe, are you likewise engaged with the manuscript? Yes, sir. We will soon know its meaning. And I bid you take your leave. <laughs> oh, I know who that dude with the green glasses is. He does seem like he might be an interesting character. Oh, she took a very astounding two feet. Better to be right about it, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying man. You can probably tell based on what I'm doing here. I've actually done this exact mission a number of times. Like, at the cutscene, the reason why I went and stood where I was to trigger the cutscene is because that's exactly where you're going to be standing when the cutscene is over, no matter where it is that you actually see the Washington, Lawrence. No matter where you see Lawrence and cause that trigger scene to, to trigger, when it's over, you'll be where I was, you think. So, uh, I stood there in the first place to maintain consistency, because I don't like randomly teleporting. He's been following them the whole time, I think. You are too late, assassin. It's never too late to ruin Templar plans, Master Washington. <laughs> But my plans are already in motion. Even leading you here <coughs> has 
has given my allies time to escape. <coughs> Thank you for making my end a quick one. You're welcome. And thank you for revealing your master plan, you scheming snake. I do not get that response, because he didn't reveal shit. He just said, hey, I'm already doing my thing. Killing me doesn't mean anything. Better hurry. Thanks for making my end quick. You brought the ship around. Thank you for revealing all of your plans. What? No, that doesn't make any sense. Whatever. There's a lot of things about this game that don't make any sense. Is that a shit mortar? That's not Spartan! Oh, you bastards! No! Ah, oh, no, I just want to take a hell of a lot longer now. Fuck you. Yeah, come on. There we go. We can't do that. Yeah, those mortars. The nice thing is when you get on the ship, you're at full health, no matter what it says that your health was beforehand. The bad thing is that you pretty much have to brace all the way through this to survive the mortar. So you turn around this corner here. Push you where the mortars can't get you anymore. Now the mortars are stopped, so bracing is actually a bad idea. And it's go as fast as you freaking can. Still gotta brace a bit because of the freaking ship. You can't steer when you're bracing, so I have to like continuously redirect and crap. But now it's just to get the hell out of here. Oh shit, that's a mine. Yeah. I did not see that mine in time. And recognize it for what it was anyway. Wait, they're not called mines in the water. What are they called? Ah. Uh, someone in the comments tell me what those are. I honestly don't remember. So we're just going as fast as possible right now. And yeah, going to travel speed actually matters. If you can get in the travel speed, wow. you can outrun the ships, but you can't outrun the mortars. You look disappointed. The sickly way that man looks. You would have been dead in a boat by the way. Well, so I you might have been got away. They're looking into the manuscript in the box. Did they have the artifacts? I don't know. Perhaps. Can't be sure. Then you did what was right by the Brotherhood. You'll find the object later. Cheer up, Shay. It's a rare day we can sow such chaos among the Templars. Perhaps. But to hear Washington speak. It didn't sound like they'd be too put out by the loss. Well, that's what he'd want you to think. No, it actually happens to be true. Because the dude was going to die in a month anyway. 
He was sickly as all shit. He knew he was dying. They knew he was dying. But I wanted to get that. <sighs> oh, that sucks. screen. The memory appears to be fragmented. How much time has passed? A few months, I think. That virus is cutting off our access to complete memories. We're readable, but messy. A seven years' war will soon break out in the colonies. Focus on assassin interference. We'll do our best. Won't we, Numskull? Every time that one says Numskull, I really want to punch the, the scriptwriter. So grim about the homestead now that Miss Abigail and little Connor have passed. Aye! I've seen Achilles crying. Why shouldn't he? It's just that he doesn't look sad. He looks furious. It's unsettling. He's struggling with the loss. We all are. I know. But it's been months. And we've done little but search for this blasted manuscript and box. All gate too. No hope of cheering me up then. When Achilles said whoever had the artifacts could access sites of great power, what does he mean? This is me being way too impatient to actually wait for the freaking ships to get close enough for me to get to. Three hits on me before I could even do anything because of jerk freaking game mechanics. More. I'm not sure I understand it myself, Shelby. We had a long talk with Adam Wally about that. He believes the box can be activated to well, project words or images. Like a magic lantern. What do you mean? You know the magic lantern shows Father Connolly put on in the church basement? The box had a candle in it, I think. He put these little glass plates in front, and you'd see the images projected on the wall like. Cathedrals in Rome, quite a near's biggest life. Loaded, ah, yeah, I suppose it is. Except that it interprets the strange language of the manuscript too. If the plate were of a banner in Latin, you can see it in English. Trigger the gunpowder, not pick up the body. Still trying to trigger the gunpowder, but these fuckers are in my way. And it's what you get. I just wonder if I could set that on fire, but they just wouldn't leave me alone.
How is that possible? Who knows? I fear we might never truly understand how any of the pieces of Eden work. Where in the world has the most beautiful girls? I suppose it depends on your vision of beauty. A damsel from Corfu and one from Oslo are as different as chalk and cheese, but both could be lovely. See, opinions like that give a man a reputation for wisdom. Yeah, thank you. I would have just said Havana. The girls there have lusty buttocks and bosoms and feel no shame in putting them on display. But that's no slight <laughs> against our lasses from home. I suppose. I think Galway has the nicest ones. Fair and modest. Always willing to spot you a penny for an ale. Fire! Drag them down! Are you being patient again? Not good at patience. Hopefully this time I don't get knocked off the boat seven times. Oh, yay! I think I said thank you for the loot. I'm not entirely sure. Somehow I haven't once done repairs on my ship that has more health than the last time I saw that same screen. I just want to find out something more like this. The materials we have aboard can approve the ship, Captain. the cargo would be so I'm happy about that. I think I got a crew up here as well. <laughs> That's also helpful. Oh, the the there we go. Over here. You don't say. Uh, as a warning, uh, I have then a timer the set to so so let me know when I've gotten around 45 Destined minutes. Destined for the convent they were. Dark eyes and kindly disposition. Separate Only the in-game from the game. Not that we spent much of our night's talk. Opinions like that give a man an entirely different reputation. Alrighty. So, uh, that was the bell for this episode. So, um, I'm gonna sail over to that, uh, ship over there, and we're gonna sink it in the next episode. Have fun.